want to smoke a little weed? Go ahead. You want to do galaxy gas? Are you fucking stupid? Yeah. Your mom spit you out for you to grow up and do galaxy gas. <laughs> yeah. That's crazy. Exactly. That's some wild. What's up with y'all? Yeah. Welcome back to another reaction video. I'm Inde. And I'm Ollie. And today we got more degenerosity internet trends. I could talk about all the stupid shit we do. <laughs> Not we, but we yeah but we're gonna let the video speak for itself because <laughs> <laughs> i already know it's gonna be some stupid shit in here that i didn't participate in i probably i probably participated in none of these things what are you looking at me like that for mm -hmm. hello i bet you probably did we'll see we'll see yeah we'll see we'll see all right yeah. all right if, if i participate in it i'll i'll actually be like a hundred percent for sure <laughs> You have to also. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. Well, look, I hope all y'all that's watching this video is taking care of yourselves. Let's get into it. The fuck? Oh, was that? Yeah, I know you did that one. <laughs> the, nah, I didn't. I didn't do that. Dominican challenge? Yes, you did. I, the, not the Dominican challenge. Many things. We'll, we'll see. We'll I know you video. did. Music videos. We'll see. Next videos. The World Wide Web <laughs> is a never-ending amount of information and media. And no the ball. biggest part of it, social media, is the way all of us can interact with each other no matter where we're from. Fuck. And one of the most popular ways we interact online and relate with huh? each other is with trends. When I Google the definition of internet <laughs> trends, it defines it as a post or an idea that is hyped or popularized yeah, for a certain period of time. But I'd more describe it as people doing goofy sh just because it's fun and cool. The trend usually starting with someone random online doing a funny dance or making up a challenge or whatever, really. That person's video goes viral, then everybody who got a phone or a camera start participating. And the trend continues to grow and cement itself in pop culture. You participated in the man mannequin challenge? Maybe playing around with my friends. I probably have. I don't remember, but I know I probably have. I just know you. I know did, I, I know I probably bro. did. I okay, well, that's did. not a no, bad. That's not a bad trend. That shit was actually pretty did, cool. No, you did. That was like actually pretty cool. That was like one of the best trends. No, yeah, I did like it too. That shit was hard. <laughs> that shit was actually hard. I'm not gonna lie. So I'm. That's the first one I participated in. I would say I probably did, but not recording. Just playing around. Aren't we all playing around? But I don't know on recording. Okay, let's. We gotta keep watching. You, 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 you just <sighs> joke right now. I'm Black Beetle is in this. It is. It is. <laughs> Killing mm. the trend overnight, making us move on to the next big thing. This is the outcome for almost all trends and challenges. It's inevitable. Is that the all good <laughs> things must come to an end. And as far as my opinion on them, I like most of them. As much as I hate on everything, really, I very much enjoy watching the latest trends. They're usually very funny or at least entertaining, even the dumb ones. Like the crate challenge, I liked it. I mean, you, you never can see what? No, that, that shit was wild. Down, but like, I sure was dying of laughter from others failing at it. I don't really why mind. Why are people doing that? I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna be honest with y'all niggas. I didn't do the. I didn't. I didn't do the car challenge, the crate challenge, whatever the shit's called. But if I was in the setting and niggas was like, "Yo, you wanna try?" Bro, no, you wouldn't. People were breaking wouldn't. their That's ribs over that I game. I probably wouldn't, cause I'll take the first step. Feel the wobble, cause, but like the thing is, a little, little, hear me out, hear me out. Like I'm hella competitive, so I'll see everybody fucking falling. I like, I got this, y'all niggas suck. Like that will make me want to do it, but realistically, I put my foot on it, and I'm like, nah, I'm good. I'm cool off this shit. I'm just competitive. Nah, he's that good competitive. He probably would do it. He'd be like, y'all can't do it, but I can. Using. If a real life Hunger Games challenge started, I'd binge watch compilations of it. The trends <laughs> or challenges I don't like, though, are the ones I don't understand. The ones that make me think, why would you do this to yourself? Who raised you? The Skull Breaker challenge, where the challenge is you trip your friend on their back of their head. This one is so fucked up. That, that's the challenge. The Benadryl huh? challenge, where the challenge was you eat a Bruh, bunch of. My fuck. Listen. You don't remember that challenge? Mm -mm. Bro, when somebody, like, you in the middle and you kick their legs. That's not even a challenge. That's like, that's fucked up. Somebody do that shit to me, we box. Benadryl, then die. The Tide Pod challenge. No. Just the names alone <laughs> are dead real. giveaways. You're gonna die doing crazy thing. I never hear of half of these challenges till someone kicks the bucket from it. The news talking about local team dies from the drink a gallon of elephant nut and butt juice. <laughs> How the 
they even find out this child is this? Making me think they made it up. They're just trying to get freaky with an elephant. Those are the dumb challenges I don't be getting. You really trying to get viral that bad? It can't be that hard. Especially if you're a white girl. All you gotta do is say an pia of you giving head, then gooners will make oh, you save for life. It nah, that shit's crazy, bro. So bro. Simple, but you rather make it hard by doing the, the oh wombat challenge or whatever the kids be doing huh? nowadays. Treads, on the other hand, I look at them a little different. To me, it could be picked up on in everyday what? life, like in the way people dress, the way they talk, <laughs> which new crypto coin to invest in, how to steal a car. Trends are very various oh. in its topics. And one trend I always thought was dumb was the money glitches, like the cash app and recently the Chase Bank money glitch. Where if that you shit don't is know, so dumb. people were able to write fake checks and deposit a bunch of money into their account. But turns out you actually weren't allowed to do that. So all the people who did do it, they weren't showering in money, but instead took a bath and dance. Some this is the thing though. Why why did they think that was like just gonna work that easily? Like, all right, I'm gonna get this and nothing's gonna happen. Niggas was lined up to do that. Now you got fraud on your record. <laughs> now you got fraud on you you really think they like, was gonna let you bypass and take their money, nigga? You think the government was gonna let when you it's a money? trend at that? Yeah, crazy. Like how do you, what? Come yeah, on, you guys. I ain't gonna lie. I think some niggas, nah, nobody got away with that shit. You even if you do get the money, you gonna have to. Oh, you gonna wake up and your shit's gonna be negatives. Fuck that. That's yeah. That was you dumb. could actually walk away with free money like it's a Mr. Beast challenge. Nah, <laughs> nigga, that was an unannounced loan that you have to pay back immediately. There ain't no such thing as free money unless you rob people or scamming <laughs> grandma. Like, did we learn nothing from that cash app? Yeah, the cash app shit was wild. Which was basically the same thing. Classic. Now, I ain't gonna lie. I fell victim for those free cash app glitches in the past. Like, in Bruh. high school, I'd get those ads. Free 500 via cash app if you answer this survey and send us your account information. And me back then, being dumb and broke, I was like, shit, sign me up. I can finally cop a PS5. I fill up the survey and send it over, and then they said my money will be there within a few business days. Next day, I then look at my cash app to find some nigga, probably named Eduardo, spending my cash app money on FUBU. I ain't signed up for this. Where my free 500? Since then, I never trusted any kind of free money glitches that be trending. Although, I'm pretty sure I just got scammed. But I digress. How some of y'all fall for these free money glitches is beyond me. Y'all just broke. You should still have some sense in you. But now you have no sense on you. Just know the next time a Wells Fargo free money glitch pops up, don't participate in it. <laughs> it's a trap. Don't be stupid. Which takes me to this other thing, which is not really an internet trend or challenge or anything like that. I just hate seeing people do it, and I have no idea how I'd bring this up in <laughs> any future video. But cave exploring is the dumbest hobby I've ever witnessed. Yo, I, I ain't gonna lie. She hates this shit. Like, she hates caves. She I doesn't do, understand it. I don't like caves. I don't understand it either, but like, no. It's because I I've seen said that before movie. How much I hate caves on here. You did when we was playing the game. Yeah, I'm not gonna go in detail. Really though, to be honest, to be honest though, for me, those. for me, it's because of that movie Descent. That shit crazy. I ain't gonna lie. We don't fuck with caves out here. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, Cave diving is. But some I be seeing some videos, and some of those caves are fucking beautiful. I ain't gonna lie. It's like a whole other world and down below. Like I seen a cave with like, like. It looked like it had a lake and some shit. Like it had like trees. That shit was crazy as fuck. Yeah, some can be pretty, but still no. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. At night, especially. Especially at night, them fun, dirt caves. Like, <laughs> them uh, dirt caves. Uh, uh. <laughs> of these dudes going through dark, small ass caverns where they have to wiggle like a worm for sometimes miles. Uh, that is crazy. That gives me so much anxiety. And, piss. and I'm just thinking, <laughs> why? Who is this fun for? Who is this appealing to? This is just torture. There are some weird hobbies where I can see mm. the appeal to. That's sky just scary. Like fun. Lemon I'd rather skydive than go in deep but in this, a cave. I, I, I can't. <laughs> I can't with this. Where's the enjoyment? You nah, are yeah, in a claustrophobic that. space. You can barely see or breathe. Yeah, how can you like breathe? And nobody can pull you out if you get off. stuck. Because after you suffered in that journey, wiggling through the cave and <laughs> rocks, you know what's going to be on the other side of all that? More rocks! It's a cave. What you think you're gonna discover, Batman? Not to mention you have to go back out. Nah, no, you're you fun, might as well man. live there and get comfortable. Start learning the bats' language. They nice when you get to know them for real. They ain't nothing fun about this to me. 
And, and no offense to the 20 people on the planet yeah. that like doing this. You do you, bro. But, but me personally, actually, like, I like not I <laughs> dying. You feel me? Very huge That's tangent, just sketchy. But I needed that for what my next topic is. Because this has got to be the most literal brain rot shit I've ever seen. You probably Talk to us. Oh my god, I knew it. I knew yet. it was going to be this galaxy. A flavored galaxy nitrous guys. oxide that the company advertises is only meant to be used for... What the hell? Cooking, I never heard of this. I'm not accusing them. Remember we was talking about the last video? The niggas is the, the galaxy gas. Niggas is like smoking this, inhaling it, whatever. Oh, I thought you were talking about something else. No, this is what they doing. Wait, play it, play it. This is so <laughs> weird. Anything, but I think they know who their main audience is. Now, I'm not accusing them of anything, but why find a video of someone supposedly repping them, advertising it at TPE 2024, a convention that's done for businesses to network their products to people looking to invest in them. But the thing is, this convention is known for advertising stuff you'd only see in a smoke shop. It's on their website. It's on their it's crazy, IG. That, that's their main target. I'm not accusing them of anything, though. But also, nah. if you look through the TPE website and look through the list of their sponsors, you can find them right next to Geek Extracts, right there. Uh, I'm not accusing them of anything, though. Because technically, anybody could advertise whatever product they're selling at this convention. But I'm not accusing them of anything, though. <laughs> but I doubt I see Gordon Ramsay trying to sell spatulas at this kind of convention. Not accusing them of anything, though. Yeah, this is meant for cooking. But most people aren't using it for that. Most people are using it to get zooted. That's Kinda just hard crazy. Said this at the end of my last That's video. wild. That stuff literally frick. kills brain cells. But at this point, I feel like everybody already knows that. Niggas just don't care. I'm stating the obvious. Feels like I'm telling people, people are just don't like the paint chips doing the this. Yeah, niggas is doing this. And the crazy thing is, I don't even know how you... I like, I like reached niggas first, like hit, that was like hillbilly shit. Like the galaxy gas shit, correct me if I'm wrong, but that galaxy gas, like hit, that was like hillbilly shit at first. I don't know how it got to the cities and shit. And, and motherfuckers. it's a trend, I guess. No, this is not a trend. Niggas is getting high. <laughs> no, are, I know, I know. But niggas I'm are crackheads. Like, <laughs> that choice of drug is trending, I guess. Oh yeah, I, I guess uh, it's not That's even a, like, it's not even a drug though. It's 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 chemical, I guess. It's because you use it to cook. And basically, it kills your brain cells. Yeah, people are just. Doing I don't. It. That shit is actually stupid, bro. Like, That's crazy. You. S you guys don't be doing drugs, please. If no, you no, care no. about yourself or your life. Yeah, don't. Don't be wasting just, your just, time. All right, I'm you could be doing this. better things with your time, honestly. You wanna, you wanna, you wanna, you wanna smoke a little weed? Go ahead. You wanna do galaxy gas? Are you fucking stupid? Yeah. Your mom spit you out for you to grow up and do galaxy gas. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's crazy. Exactly. That's some wild. Yeah. Hey, my message to you is love no yourself. Does. We all know the horrors <laughs> right? of it by now, but dudes still out here buying and posting their gas on Look their at these socials, niggas, bro. showing off as if they're doing the money. I can't even something. like process that that's real. Folk making jokes saying the CIA won, but I genuinely think they have. I thought people would know better by now not to right, do this bro. stuff. Like, have y'all not seen Requiem for a Dream? Or any episode of Ren and Stippy, cause ain't no way they're sober making that. We already know the effects that these things have on the mind and body. Yet dudes are still using galaxy gas. And in my head at this point, it's just natural selection. You know, someone once yeah. said, don't save her. She don't want to be saved. <laughs> Which I view that quote meaning, mind your business. Cause you already told them a million times not to. So let them rot. I believe Genghis Khan said that. Genghis Khan. I ain't got much more to add on this situation that hasn't already been said a million times. But if you're using gas, you dumb as a brick. Everybody God. around you think that too. I could say this is the worst generation when it comes to trends, but that's fuck? such a boomer take. There's been stupid people doing stupid things in every era, including yeah. the ones I look back on fondly. But this is up there, not gonna lie. And that's all I really wanted to say. Man, I just be talking to my vids. Why y'all watch me? <laughs> hey, nah, that galaxy gas shit. Looking. Okay, stop looking. Mm? I gotta use the bathroom. Okay, in conclusion, bye. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, what? I don't know. <laughs> that, that galaxy gas shit is the worst. I ain't gonna lie. But what just makes you decide to do that? Like. If just, you're peer pressured into doing galaxy gas, it ain't even peer you need pressure. Therapy. Though. Don't even give them the excuse of that. They're just, they're just, just dumb. I'm surprised he didn't, he didn't do the the lip challenge shit with the bottle, with the water bottle. 
The Kylie Jenner challenge. I mean, that's so old. Maybe he just said. No, that was that was recent. What was that? 20, 2020, Speed did that shit, and he, and he thought his shit was going to get stuck. The Kylie Lip Challenge? No, that's way older than 2020. It is? Yeah. I'm not sure. What the fuck was Speed doing? He was doing it for fun? Like, he maybe tried to bring it, was, it back? Maybe it was just trending again? I don't know. Really? But I know that shit was hella old. Did you do it? <laughs> no. That didn't sound convincing. Did you do it? Fuck no. Because your lips are already big. See, and they luscious too, and they moisturized. I don't need the water bottles. Mm-hmm. Don't need the water <laughs> bottles. But that's really the only... What other crazy ass trends though? Because I wanted to talk about this in the beginning, but I didn't want to like... <laughs> delay the video. What other crazy trends were there? The emoji outfits. Yeah. Yeah, who, who the fuck would wear emoji pants and shit like that? Like, come on now. Mm. Are you wearing emoji outfits? Nah, I wasn't. I wasn't wearing emoji outfits. I wasn't wearing emoji. Then why outfits. you? Why are you getting? What are you saying? Where are you getting that? I didn't wear emoji outfits, but I wore the the, the hundred joggers. <laughs> I don't know if that counts. Nah, I guess it's emoji. But right yes, side. it does count because the hundred is an emoji. Yeah. This this dude. He's about to say this nigga. The thing is though, like, all right, that that wasn't that. The emoji joggers aren't crazy. The ones that got like the actual yellow niggas, <laughs> those is crazy. And if you got the full fit, cause I had the emoji joggers, red sixes, you know, and a black sweater. That shit was that shit was kind of cool. <laughs> that shit was kind of cool. I wasn't looking goofy as fuck for the time. If I wear that shit now, it's like, what are you doing? <laughs> but then it was like, yeah, it was. I don't know. To me, emojis was just like, what the heck? Nah, if you're a girl and you got an emoji fit on, you need to be fucking slapped. That's nigga. That's like nigga shit. I never seen a girl with an emoji fit on. That's like, that's like super hood. Nah, I haven't. Emoji fit. That's like you know you. with that you a hot cheeto girl. I'm God, you a hot cheeto girl. It's it's a certain things dudes could do and a certain things uh, women could do. Putting on the emoji outfit as a girl is, is insane. Like you, you just know like who you like. You know who, what type of girl that is. A nigga with the emoji fit, like you could be like, oh, like you don't know what type of nigga he is. He could be autistic. <laughs> he could be a street nigga. He could be a school stop. nigga. <laughs> we're gonna stop right there. <laughs> we're, we're gonna. We're gonna. We should. We should end this right here. Nah, that's crazy. That's in my role. <laughs> oh shit. That's crazy. Well, look, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, comment, subscribe if you're new. Catch y'all on the next video. video. Later.